Come on. My God, I can't believe it. Another episode for you guys to listen to with your ear holes. And your families, because this is the Christmas special. This is the Christmas special. Plug this we in. Watched, um, Home Alone. A Christmas classic. Home Alone. Um, <laughs> expectations going into this movie. Let's start with that. I was expecting a great movie because you said it was a great movie. I said, yeah, no, I mean, I watched it a lot and I liked it as a kid. I was expecting fun and Have you seen it before? No. He's never seen it. You've never seen it? That is very surprising. Not all the way through. You know what Sal said? I didn't know that. What the fuck? I didn't like how Macaulay Culkin looked at looked like when I was a kid for some reason. What the hell? <laughs> that was like I think a main, Greg was jealous he was so That was like cute. a main reason why I didn't watch the I'm movies. Not cute, I'm not cute. Because the like, boy was too cute? <laughs> no, 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 no. I, didn't, yeah, I thought he looked weird. <laughs> I think you're just jealous, dude. Macaulay was the cute. I didn't like his face. Kid, I was like, I don't want to watch that. I've watched the third one and the fourth one a lot. What the fuck? <laughs> you, you, you're lying to me right now. No, I'm dead serious. <laughs> Are you kidding? I remember those. I remember Are you those serious? Ones. You watched the third this. and the fourth? Those movies are dog shit. Yeah, of course they are. Yeah. Oh no, my I, God. I, this is so much better than those. Yeah, I know, I'm, I'm never surprised seen you the third started the with that. They're I've not worth watching at all. They, yeah, no. they were just, I, the only it's reason. It's just a new kid, same plot. Yeah. Except the a only, little different. Is that really all they are? It's oh, not, yeah. a, it's, they stopped doing well, the one, Christmas thing like, completely. <laughs> really? Yeah. Eventually. One, there's like, it's like, there's like, some terrorists. Terrorists, yeah. What yeah. the fuck? There was like a bunch of dudes in like black. Yeah, the, and they... the guys get more like <laughs> cool. Yeah, they and like they're kind of like they look like spies breaking into a house and this kid. Oh, is now I kind of want to watch this one. No, I don't, I don't know if it's the third know. or the fourth. We're not. No, that's just gonna be frustrating. They're terrible I don't think that's though. Gonna be good, bad, to be honest. Yeah, no, I've seen probably it. not. They're, Especially right after watching Home Alone, they would just be on <laughs> ABC. Yeah, like I've seen this enough. Right like now. all every all the good parts that make this movie good are completely absent in those movies. Well, yeah. to be fair, you've never seen them. So <gasps> no, I've seen them. I've seen two and three, but not four. Two is still Macaulay Culkin. Two is still McCann. I like McCann. And McCann- that one is different. McCann- that one is that McCann- one at least <laughs> doesn't copy. It's not a complete copy of the first one. At least I know well, I haven't seen it. Would be hard to do that if it's the same kid. Yeah. But it's, it's, he's does lost. Joe in... Pesci uh, return? They know. all return. Everyone comes back. The really? mom too. Yeah. It's. I think it's just really. I think the whole. Okay. The movie itself. I does think he get left good. alone again? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's this so time, stupid, dude. But not at home. He's like in. He gets like <laughs> he's in New York City. And he he's accidentally gets on a different plane and he's like you know stuck in New York and he like uses his dad's credit card to like rent like a hotel room and stuff, and oh, like he so gets into hijinks in like, like he, But he's no, he's alone city. in New York. Yeah. yeah. I think that's what it's called. Home Alone 2. Lost, Lost in, New, in New, York. New York. yeah. And, like, that movie's pretty good. Like, Joe Pesci and Marv come back. and That's great. They're the sticky bandits now. <laughs> <laughs> Marv, like, came up with the idea. He has a bunch of, like, I don't even know, like, tape or something, like, around his arms. And you, he just, like, sticks onto, like, purses and shit and just, like, snatches it. I don't know. It's a really, it was a really stupid idea. But, um, yeah, no, the movie's, I mean, it's the general, it's the same concept, you know. He does more, like, you know. Of the shit that you know you liked in this movie at the at the you know final showdown, and I know Donald Trump has a cameo. Donald, yeah, I like that cameo. That was a pretty good cameo, and yeah. Huh, I did not know that. Interesting. But then third and three, that's when that's it when the things weird. get good. Yeah, <laughs> things get good. What what's the third one? Uh, it's a I new kid. But one I mean, of them's the terrorist one. I don't remember. Yeah, which I don't one. know which one's the terrorist one, but I barely remember them. I know Scarlett Johansson is one of the sisters in those. What the oh, fuck? fun shit. fact? Yeah, in three or four, they were just pumping I don't know them which out. One. They just saw Home Alone. They just started pumping out kid being Home Alone. And, but the thing is, the kid gets much older, and it's not as cool anymore that he's like you know alone. Mm. So I'm like, what's the point of this? It, it becomes like a weird, like, kid action movie. I don't even fucking know. Yeah. It's strange. But what did you guys think of this one? Uh, you know Hollywood what version? I was pleasantly surprised about? I thought more of the movie... I think I used to think that this movie was kind of, like, um, gimmicky. 
I thought like most of the movie was like him doing the traps and shit. Me too. But it's really like Me a too. very small part of the movie. Yeah, it's and the final showdown. And that's uh, the, it. Yeah, the movie had more substance than I thought it was going yes, to. Yes, absolutely. I thought it was gonna be very like throughout most of the movie, just like him doing all this shit. But it was yeah, really only a small period of time when mm-hmm. he was doing that. For mm-hmm. me, I knew it was a wholesome movie, and I knew like the mom thing. And the whole family, like, theme and, you know, all that. Yeah, yeah. It was perfect. I knew about that. But I thought the majority of the movie just revolved around him doing these, like, you know, goofy things to, you know, the bandits. And it was just going to be a lot more of that. But that was only, like, maybe 20 minutes. Yeah. And the rest of the movie... But I, I think that's also works to his detriment a bit. Because, like, a lot of the movie, I felt like they were just, like, wasting time almost. Like, they were just, like, pointless scenes. Mm-hmm. Like, and, like, like long, grocery long... shopping. Sh- yeah. Yeah, stuff like that. Yeah. I like the stuff that they did with the neighbor, though. I love that. I didn't that remember that great. at all. Yeah. I remembered that, but that I didn't good. remember it being this good. I thought yeah, I... it was much more... I th- okay, I didn't know that the church scene happened before... He rescues him at his house. Mm. So that makes him rescuing him at the house much more goofy that they didn't have the first interaction. But they did have that interaction. Yeah. So that made it really, really good. Uh-huh. I really like that. Yeah. I thought... I didn't know there'd be as much backstory. I thought he'd... I, it, I You could tell he was gonna, like, not be actually creepy, obviously. It's so mm-hmm. obvious. Yeah. And I thought it's just at the very end he'd like help him. a smirk him. or something. Yeah, yeah, he'd, yeah, he'd help him and then give him a smirk or something. Uh-huh. And that'd yeah. be it. Yeah, that'd be dumb. But I, there was so that's much what, more. Yeah, I thought yeah, that's the very good point. lane they went in. But no, they didn't go in that way. So props to them for that. Yeah, that mm. was good. Um, the, the mom, dude, I loved the mom. Like that was like yeah, she was good. Yeah, dude, her she face was doing... when she like comes back yes. to see Kevin. Yes. Like I thought she was doing well before. When I saw her face, I'm like, okay, this woman can act. Like, yeah, really I good. loved her really the entire yeah. movie. And like she really just sold the idea of like. Like, you guys just go, like, you know, enjoy the trip or, like, you know, come back whenever, you know, you want. Like, I'm going to go back to Kevin. Like, that's just such a mom thing, dude. Like, that's Mm -hmm. such a pure mom thing. Yeah. And then, like, she just keeps going and, like, you know, she's, like, pleading with people to, like, you know, get their tickets Mm -hmm. so she can go back. And, like, she just sold that shit so well. You just believe that she was a mom. You believe that, like, she genuinely just, like, wanted to get home to her kid because she was that worried. Yeah, she's a very, yeah, very good actress. And then, yeah, she hopped around, and then she, you know, got on the truck and everything. And, like, yeah, the, when she finally gets to Kevin, like, that moment was so good. Mm-hmm. That was such a warm moment. That was good. So, yeah, I love that. The wholesomeness was beyond my expectation. I didn't think it was this heavy. Yeah, it was a very, uh-huh, good, like, just, like morally good mm-hmm. it yeah feels good after. Feels this is, good, this good is after like and i think that's just what like christmas is about that's why i think this is such a good like pure christmas movie like mm-hmm. i don't know any like even like like elf and all that other bullshit like I, it's it doesn't the give not you this, bad it's just no not. but it's just not like this it doesn't give you this kind of feeling you know yeah and i just associate like that feeling so much with just like christmas time mm-hmm. and the holiday season you know mm-hmm. so yeah i still do think it's a very great christmas movie for sure Agree. Yeah, I, I. Greg, yeah, you're a newcomer, so I was. I want more of you. Yeah, no, it's I even when I told. I Cell, wish I knew that coming in, dude. Yeah, when I told. Yeah, Cell, we we went. We've been over this <laughs> twice in two different podcasts. How I haven't seen it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I told Sal that like we're seeing Home Alone because uh you know Greg hasn't seen it yet. And he's like, the movie guy has not seen Home Alone yet. Yeah, right. Because it's so just unbelievable that he hasn't seen Home Alone. But. Yeah. Yeah, I want. I want to hear your thoughts. What did you think? What, what What were your emotions? My emotions were. I loved the wholesomeness. Uh, yes, but it was. It, the, I wasn't that into it at the beginning. And yeah, the middle. I thought. The, I thought the beginning was slow. The middle, it had its good parts. Yeah. But yeah, the the more the movie progressed, I thought the better it got. Yeah, like I him going to church what, and like all that. Yeah, stuff. That was like good. Just, the directing just got a lot better too. Basically, I yeah, from the church on, that's when I was into it. Mm-hmm. Um, but I was most into um, it. the interaction with the Santa. And him going to like that one. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Come on, yeah, like no, cool. it really starts to 
kick into high gear, like, yeah. as it, the more the movie progresses. Mm-hmm. And the directing just starts to get so much better. Yeah, I, but for me, it was when, once the tricks start happening and the traps are set, I was glued <laughs> to the screen, baby. <laughs> That was so well said. I ate that shit up. I love that Same, shit. Same, I didn't expect to like it as much as I did. That was so much fun, man. I thought it would be good, but I didn't think it would be as I entertaining it. as it was. I was like, fuck I'm yeah, seen, these are great. I've seen it so I love seeing times. these guys get hurt. Yeah. yeah no, I, thought they were good. I, didn't think, I definitely did not think they were that good. I loved it. I did. I, I, I enjoyed it. I didn't like eat it. that shit up, but like, you know, I really, I thought it was much. See, I, I kind of wish the whole movie good. was the traps, man. Yeah. I completely disagree. I feel like they also get old really fast. I think they had the perfect amount of traps. You're probably, Tony, you I, know, agree, you're Tony prob- I agree with you, but then, like, I also think about, like, those just slug-ish scenes. Like, yeah. those long scenes, and I'm like, you know what, I would love to. I think, some, I would sh- I think those sluggish right scenes should be out, but I don't think they should be replaced with trap shit. <laughs> you're probably <laughs> you're right. right. Okay, you're right. You're, you're definitely right. You're probably right, right but... I don't. I don't know. I just enjoyed. Like okay, I, I just enjoyed the tricks. And you could shit. do if you could do a You're trick. Right. If you could do a trap yeah. cut. A of trap home alone, cut. Tri- tricks and traps. They should release cut. that as like a like a bo- like a, a in bonus, the DVD bonus yeah. pack, like yes. a trap cut where you <laughs> release. Tra- it's just like two hours of straight traps. Release the two hours straight trap, trap cut. cut. <laughs> release the trap cut, bitch. We know you got it. Sorry, Macaulay's we know probably, you have it. Macaulay probably has it. He owns it. He bought it from the studio. That's his retirement money. Yeah, he's he waiting until he runs All out right, of his own money. Yeah, and then yeah. he's like, hey, you want the trap? <laughs> yes, 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 give it to me give now. Give it to Kelly. <laughs> I'll pay anything. I'll pay anything. <laughs> anything. And then he <coughs> gets so much money. <laughs> <laughs> He dedicates his life to philanthropy from there. Yeah. And he's he, he starts just, giving handouts. And he's like the economic genius of the twenty first <laughs> century. Yeah, I, know. I just kind of like released the trap cut <laughs> with all this money. He knows the perfect fucking time to release the trap cut, and I don't think we should rush him. No, you're right. But I don't you're think we right. should try to delay him either. I think, <laughs> I think we should let him release it when he sees fit. Oh yes, please do I not trust de- his judgment. do not delay him. Don't fucking joke about this, dude. I'm not. <laughs> You're gonna jinx Are you it. Are kidding me? I was the one who first announced my support of the trap cut. No, but now you're making a joke out of it. A mockery. And it's insulting. To me. And to, Sash, to McCully. And to McKelly. No, get out of here. <laughs> you said you said he was ugly too. I did I did think he was ugly back then, but I oh think he's a cute kid. No, how do you think he's ugly? He looked like a little monkey. Boy. I know he, he just I didn't like, like his like face. I was like, he looked I, like a little monkey. He was like yeah. a he was like a he hateable so cute. he was like a hateable face for me when I was a kid. I was like, really? I don't like him. I think you're just jealous, dude. I, dude, I, I think, think this that's is coming it. from a place this is, of yeah, green, this is not green coming jealousy. from a good place. Hulk green jealousy. Yeah, dude. This you, this, you guys this shut your mouth. Shut up. No, shut up. I think stop talking about this. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Look really bad. Just say you always thought he was cute. We'll cut the other shit out. I always thought he was cute. I loved him. All right, now we can move on. All right. Uh, I love Joe Pesci. He was great. And then the Holy other guy. Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> Joe Pesci, yeah, he was fantastic. Joe Pesci was definitely and the best. And Marv was surprisingly, like, on Joe Pesci's level, too. Yeah, dude, Marv was, that's another pleasant was. surprise. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah, coming into watching it again, I really thought that, like, I thought Joe Pesci would be pretty good. Uh-huh. Yeah, I thought Marv was going to be like, oh, this guy's so fucking cringy. Yeah. But Marv was really good, too. Yeah, yeah like, was, I knew yeah, Marv had some... They were both really good. <laughs> I knew Marv had some, like, good reactions and stuff, like the tar scene. The scream with and, the... And, like, the screams and stuff, like, with good. the tarantula. Oh, yeah, like, I remember, like those being good but I didn't remember like him just as a character being that entertaining and this time yeah. around no, he was actually pretty funny he was, yeah I liked him I, I think it was a good contrast <laughs> maybe he committed suicide that was yeah, the that was, like, the that yeah. was yeah that was probably yeah that's true <laughs> he was so scared he just committed <laughs> suicide <laughs> what the fuck this little six year old kid was so scared that he killed himself <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's great and man th- this movie made that the movie that was like, you know, that they kept showing. Oh yeah, the black and white movie. The black they, and they white watching. movie. They made that movie iconic with this movie. Yeah. yeah, that's a good point. Which is crazy. Yeah. Yeah. I think my the scene I laughed the hardest was the pizza boy scene. The pizza yeah, boy yeah, one yeah, was yeah. so was good because the dialogue with the um, that's actually like you know in the scene. 
Like went so well with like <laughs> yeah. what he the actual responses could be. So good. Uh-huh. It's just a little off. Uh, and when they redid it, it was still I still liked it, but it wasn't you know. It wasn't I like good. that they had the firecracker. Yeah, that definitely. Because like he that was, was a really listening, element. and he was like you know so into it. And if you heard the firecrackers along with like the, I mean, it's gonna sell it much more. So I liked it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Good. He also, it's kind of clever. <laughs> like Kelly Culkin used the same clip in two different ways. Yeah, that's true. Like the yeah, first way, point. he was like. It was like supposed to be tricking him, like this guy's talking to you, like get yeah. on my property. But the second time, it was like, like to make Marv think that like two people were inside the house talking to yeah. each other. Cause yeah, because at first I was like, oh, he messed up. He, he yeah, no. Kid, but no, he wasn't. Uh-huh. He Macaulay's didn't mess a kid up. genius. Yeah, by that the way. kid is so <laughs> fucking smart, dude. Yeah, that's the I, thing. I is wish I was, his I was, his I was his smart his, as a his kid. tricks and traps didn't ma- really match no, that well dude, with most his adults were, That mannequin thing where he's like puppeteering the mannequin. That was the craziest that was one. And that was, that was, yeah, a fucking was blown like away a flathead taped to a train set going across the room. Uh huh. That is some shit that most adults would never think. I would not be able to think of that. Yeah. Yeah. No. That was. And he timed wild. it well too. Yeah. Dude. <laughs> That was fucking insane. <laughs> he needs to get into the FBI or something. Yeah. Like, he's so, what? This kid needs to be stopping threats. He needs to be, yeah, yeah. <laughs> stopping threats. Also, he was like, why didn't he brag about it when his parents came home? That was so That makes it even cooler, dude. Yeah, that's, that's true. what I, yeah, it that's like insane. Cooler, he's just he like, a, to be he's like, the, whatever. Dude, he needs to be in the military. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this guy needs to be fighting for Like in the country. Marines or something. He's Rambo. The Navy. He's yeah, basically dude. Rambo. Yeah, can you imagine his skills as an adult? He'd be like a superhero. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this seriously is like an origin story. <laughs> yeah, Blue Bruce origin Wayne couldn't story. do this shit. Dude, that... Dude, you could so make him become like Batman. With the rich parents. And then they go to a place. Yeah, that's a good shit, point, yeah. And then boom, he's fucking Batman Macaulay. And then you, if they make a movie about that, you like feel it even more because of like if the mom dies like right in front of it. And like the like, butler could be like the angry stuff. uncle. Yeah, <laughs> dude. Yeah, Uncle Frank. Yes. And Joe Pesci's the Joker. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Marv is a Harley Quinn. Yes. <laughs> Very good, dude. This would be sick. This is such a good idea. <laughs> oh, I'd love to see Joe Pesci as the Joker. Yeah, no. <laughs> You should have gotten that offer by now. It's a shame. It's a job. Shame. Didn't one of those boys get who was news Joker? Oh yeah, Jack Nicholson. There you go. I don't think they were in a movie to get or uh, maybe they, wait was it was Joe Pesci and who flies? Who, oh no, that was Danny DeVito. Oh, one flew over. The one flew over. Yeah. Yeah, that was Danny DeVito. Whoops. Danny DeVito. Danny Davido. Yes. But, um... Uh, I, I like this movie, but I didn't, I didn't quite think it was in the same ranks as Gremlins and Die Hard. I agree, too. Yeah. I agree, too. I didn't think it was as good as those. But the thing is, the wholesome thing, the Christmas vibe, I think it does that better than, like, Die Hard. Oh, yeah. And most Christmas oh, movies. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah. I think it gets you in that for feel sure. more. Uh, you know, that feel, that Christmas feel. Oh, yeah. That's mm-hmm. what's That's... important for a Christmas movie more than anything. Yeah. But, yeah, and I still do think Gremlins, I think Gremlins is my favorite Christmas movie, for sure. But I do like, I still do like Home Alone very much. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Tony? Yeah, no, I'm kind of in the same ballpark there. Yeah, I think Gremlin's my favorite. Die Hard second. Home Alone third on the Christmas mm-hmm. movies. Yeah, nothing to add there. Any real complaints? Do you got, uh... What um... were you going to say? I was gonna ask, did you guys? What are your thoughts on Christmas Vacation? What is I've that? never seen it. I've never oh. seen it. I know it's a I National like it. Lampoon. It's thing. it's very like over quoted, and it's you know it's like crazy. Like you know, it's just so everyone loves it. Like it's a very. I think it's a little overrated. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. But what's your what's your favorite like Christmas movie for sure? Is it Die Hard? Yeah, but if I had to pick a real Christmas movie. Uh, I uh, Die Hard Two. Die Hard Two. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, yeah, Die Hard is my favorite, and then Gremlins is probably second. Yeah, see, like Gremlins. I'm man, Gremlins blanking smack. on other ones though. Yeah, I really see. Like, like that's because I don't know. I don't think they do Christmas movies that well. Yeah. 
Maybe outside from like the animated. I ones, do. Like, I do like Elf. Oh, the Grinch, obviously. Mm-hmm. The cartoon. The Elf Grinch. is decent, but I mean. I still, yeah, yeah, I like. Elf. I think it's I don't think it's good. aged well. I haven't really. seen it in a yeah, while. I haven't seen it in a while either. So I, I can't can say recently. on that. Um, I don't know, it just wasn't that funny anymore. I don't know. Because yeah, it's, it's to... very. It's everywhere, you know. Yeah, that's. I don't yeah, that's kind of why. Nah. That's what I'm thinking. And yeah. What are the Chris Harry Potter movies? I mean, those are those yeah. are yeah. Christmas <laughs> movies. Yes, they are. <laughs> No, <laughs> they, they, ev- each one takes place over the course of a year. They're not Christmas movies. Yeah, but everyone <laughs> associates Harry Potter with Christmas time. I don't even think that's true. I think a little bit. Thirty-one more days like the of fall. Harry Potter. ABC Family. That everyone. Was that's not. Over. That's not in. You fucking idiot. That's not in December. <laughs> they do Christmas movies. <laughs> I thought they did the Harry Potter thing. They play December. some of them, but it's it's all Christmas. It's not just all Harry Potter. I only remember Harry Potter December. I thought the 31 Days of Harry Potter was in October. Also, I don't think it's in October. Yeah, it's definitely not December. Let me look it up. Let it's me not. Look it up. I think it's more like, I don't like know why I'm October thinking December, it's then. like Halloween, like witches and warlocks and shit. Maybe that, it's uh, November. That makes sense, but at the same time, I want to say it's December because I always I remember 31 Days of Harry Potter. Well, there's 31 Days in October, too. That's very true. <laughs> That's very true. <laughs> That's why it can't be November. Uh, yeah. Batman Returns is a Christmas movie. It's all the right. The one we watched? No, the oh. sequel with Danny DeVito Penguin. Oh. I, I watched the Harry, first ten minutes of that the Potter other day. Marathon. That was it. <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, yeah. What are you looking up again? Harry Potter Marathon, ABC Family. <laughs> 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 Thank you. <laughs> Wow, very, very to the point. Yeah, very factual. Yeah. Oh, they're ending? What? <gasps> no, they ended in 2017? What? And Ew, they ended what? Slime. Why are you calling Sasha Slime? R.I.P. Free for Marathons. Oh. HBO is officially streaming all. Oh my god, HBO, <laughs> these fucks. Oh, that means it'll be free to watch fuck? when we do it, though. Fuck you, boy. <laughs> 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 I want my marathon. <laughs> Fuck you, boy. I want my marathon. <laughs> Fuck you, boy. Yeah, the boy was weird. <laughs> Fuck you, boy. <laughs> All right. There's never a boy you don't know well enough to say their name when you're telling them, to, like when you're saying "fuck you" to them. Yeah. It's interesting. <laughs> yeah. Have you guys ever told a random stranger? Fuck you. Definitely not. But definitely, definitely not a young boy. Like, if I could <laughs> think it would be someone adult. Yeah. I would never say fuck you to a stranger that's a child. Yeah. And I would. I can't imagine myself ever doing it to an adult either. Yeah, I would never have the balls unless <laughs> but I feel like especially I was really wrong. you know? Yeah. I've never been that wronged yeah, before. Yeah, I'm picturing, like, being public. out, like, in the store. Yeah, like. Yeah. Like, what could someone possibly do to me at the grocery store where I. Fuck you! Be- fuck you! <laughs> But yeah, if something that bad happened, dude, that's like fucking that's shit. a blind side. Yeah, shit. I could never imagine going to like the store or something, like getting gas and like being offended so much by somebody that I'd have to like scream. Damn about. it! They do it on the weekend of Thanksgiving. <laughs> I think that's why I associate it's so close to December. Uh, but but they do. Everyone knows all the weekend the before Thanksgiving is thirty-one days long. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't think it's weekend before; it's weekend of. It's a little fun fact. That's why I feel so long. Why do they do Thanksgiving? On Thanksgiving weekend. I don't know. But they have marathons all the time, though. That's... Wait, I thought you said they were dead or something. <laughs> no, they're dead now, but they did. They were. They did for a while. Dead. They did now they're for, dead. For, like, they did a now long, dead. long time. They did now they're dead. Oh, they did Jesus, they're dead. that's dark. They did now they're dead. Ooh. Yeah, great, great, great Christmas movie. Great Christmas movie. Great time. Yeah. Harry yeah, it was Potter? a great time. Harry Potter? Oh. No, not Harry Potter. Home Alone. Oh, well, I'll talk about Harry Potter. When we do Harry Potter, it's the Mortal Kombat theme song. Oh, sorry, Total Recap theme song. Oh, sorry. Oh. Excuse me? Did like, because when we do Harry Potter, it won't be a Christmas episode. What did you say? Did you just leak information? No, I didn't. I didn't say. I I... cut that out at 24 minutes. Yes. In 30 seconds. Yes, of course. Sorry, why. sorry, we jump cutted people. Sorry. sorry, whoa. Greg said something stupid. Yeah. 
You guys are creeping me out. What? Jesus. Oh my god, it feels like it's been an hour. <laughs> Has it? It's been 25 minutes. 25 minutes. <laughs> yeah, it feels like it's been a long time. Can we call it? <laughs> it oh, I don't think, like I don't think we should have a touch. Tr- I don't think we should cheat our audience that much, Tony. <laughs> Pretty funny. We replaced a 25 minute episode. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there really wasn't that. Okay, yeah. Complaints. We didn't even get the complaints. I have none. What did you... Okay, shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> and you shouldn't either, Yeah, we talked Mr. about it a little bit boy. earlier, but the weird thing where Kevin would look right at the camera and say something. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. I'd never been a fan of that. Um, so, what know, did you guys think of Macaulay's acting in general? That was pretty good. Yeah, I thought he was fine. I thought he did, like, the scared pretty well. I think he did... I think he did emotions well. I think he did, like, the happy yeah, as well. Yeah, the reaction and stuff. I, uh-huh. And, yeah, just, like... Just acting like a kid when there's just no talking involved. And I don't think, but no, I don't think the talking was like a problem because I thought he did fine when he was like talking to um, the guy in the church, the creepy guy in the church. I okay, that, that was scene fine. was good. Yeah, so I feel he like, gets better. No, he uh, no, gets I better. think it's like a lot of the him talking is like bad because it's like it's not necessarily his fault. It's like a weird like setup thing where he has to like be in the mirror and like singing a song or something. It's like, yeah. there's not much he can do about that. That's true. I think that's more of like the you know like the that's just a writing like, thing. Yeah. yeah, yeah, true. Okay, good point. Good point. But like, yeah, like when he's like talking to the guy or like talking to the Santa and everything. Like when he has like an actual like setup scene of dialogue. Yeah. Uh huh. I think that's when he's like like I don't notice. I don't think his acting's bad then. I think yeah. it's pretty good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's pretty yeah. not great, but it's like it's pretty it's better than. Amber agreed. Said. Agreed. Okay. Uh huh. You got me. Mm-hmm. Greg, what do you think? Gotcha. <laughs> um. It just was a little slow for a while, and it wasn't grabbing me. And um, uh, all the all the jokes up until like the tricks and stuff weren't really that funny to me. Agreed. I thought it was funnier than I uh, thought it would be. How funny did you think it was gonna be? Like really, really bad. But the, I laughed more than I thought I was going to. See, I was hoping that it would at least be decent. And I was kind of let down <laughs> about that, but what? It, but it still wasn't terrible. It wasn't. Like, I think it was decent. It was. Mm-hmm. I think that's the level it's at. I thought it was. Fine. I laughed I more. I thought it was fine. I was laughed fine. more Gremlins than Home Alone. Oh, that's oh, a fucking movie. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Gremlins was beautiful. Yeah, yeah. that movie was pretty funny. And whatever it doesn't have like writing wise like it makes up for plenty with the cinematography so i don't I, it doesn't even matter oh that, that much so good mm-hmm. like the more i think about it oh my god yeah mm-hmm. that's so fun mm-hmm. <laughs> as, i was not expecting it to be as fun as it was yeah i thought it'd be get a little slow and it'd be like i wanted to see the gremlins but no that was fine it was just the ending the that build was up slow. was so cool the yeah. build up was the best part yeah that was thought. really fun yeah <laughs> Oh man! You just, oh, the suspense was so well done. Uh huh. Jeez, Jesus! <laughs> My God! <laughs> wow! Gremlin Gremlins is the Christmas movie. Yes. It's yeah, I the think so. one. I think it's the best one for sure. Fantastic. <laughs> it's not in the. Not by the you same. You won't find it on any list. All right, it's yeah. a hidden gem. Sorry. Not in the same metric as like a like a Rudolph or like a Home Alone, but yeah, it's got a little twisted vibe on it. But it, it but like, it, but yes. it's unique, yes. and it still is very Christmas, yo. Yeah, very it's Christmas. creatively Christmas. It's creatively Christmas. Creatively it doesn't have to be the same shit, like with all yeah. the movies. You don't need a little boy. <laughs> no little For boys it. involved. You don't need a kid. You don't need it a kid. It wasn't a kid. No. Well, there was a kid, but he was like a weird side character. Yeah, oh, yeah, he disappeared after a while. There was no he got, presence. He got killed by one of the it wasn't cute. <laughs> it doesn't need to be cute. Huh? The Although it was, was it was pretty. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah, no, that was cute. But Gizmo. I mean... Mogwai. It's Gizmo. His name's Mogwai. Mogwai is the name of the species. Greg, shut the fuck up. No, do they? Ama- no, no, no. You're t- dude. You're being really, you're being really, really insensitive. Yeah. Mogwai, and then they become Mogwai is the real name. Gizmo is something that. That's his... The 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 daddyo manufactured up. Mm-hmm. His natural name is Mogwai. What else? What if I start calling you fuckhead? Is your name fuckhead now? Because I gave Cause it to I, you, cause fuckhead. Because that's, that's what I'm calling you now, fuckhead. Oh, <laughs> or is your name Greg? Because that's the name you were born Jesus. with. Jesus. <laughs> you were born with. <laughs> Sadly, yes. Wait, is your full name Gregory? Yes. Okay, that's neat. <laughs> that's pretty neat. It's 
pretty fucking neat. So yeah, you wouldn't like it if I called you fuckhead, so don't no, call him Gizmo. No, stop that! <laughs> so don't call him Gizmo. Knock it off! Yeah, don't call him Gizmo. Just, we're just saying. Sorry, Mogwai. Mogwai. Thank you. There you go. <laughs> served. I've been served. <laughs> it happens to all of us. It's whatever. Yeah. Like I don't know. I hope it happens to you, but... It has, and it will oh, again. I'm going to fill Greg in on the thing that we I learned about pumping iron. So you know me. how, uh... Oh, yeah, this is pretty fucked this up. This is really <laughs> fucked up. I didn't know what you were going to say for a second, but yeah, now I remembered. Yeah, this is fucked up. <laughs> oh, my. So as uh, I told in the this previous podcast, um, Lou Ferrigno's daddy in a uh, <laughs> he probably, oh, yeah, shit. Oh, no. Yeah, you already know it's fucking bad. <laughs> <laughs> we said some stuff. Yeah. Like, the caption of pumping... Oh, no, never mind. You it good? was fuck. It was... The caption of the pumping iron video was, fuck you, Lou. But I, fr- I, fr- I thought it was about his dad. I had one about his dad. Never mind. Uh, just okay. continue. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> I thought we'd get in trouble with the, the No, no, no. No one's coming after us, Greg. No. <laughs> oh, I thought that's you think we're getting death threats from the Ferrigno family? <laughs> yeah. That's what you I thought. You thought that was the news? Yeah. I was pretty... I, 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 it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. <laughs> Thank God yeah. it's not that. Anything is better so you than you know this how now. Lou got third? He obviously wasn't even uh, good enough to be second, right? Of course. So, <laughs> what a weird way this. to phrase that, you asshole. Lou, you look he great. wasn't even good Lou, enough you look to great, be second. But you, you, you weren't good enough to be second because Serge was Ouch. second. Serge was, oh my God. But, um, yeah, so because he got third. And you know how in the movie, like, his dad was like, oh, it's okay, Lou. It's mm-hmm. okay, Lou. You still look great, Lou. When you were, when you had your arms up, it was great, Lou. Mm-hmm. And, you know, it was all, like, you know, uh, fun and stuff. And they're on the bus. And it's all cute with Arnie. Mm-hmm. Dude, Matty Frigno disowned <laughs> Lou after that for his placing in, um, yeah, in that 1970, well, I don't even know, oh, Olympia. What a fucking ass and, shit. Yeah, and Lou got so traumatized. That's why he stopped bodybuilding. Completely, and didn't come That's back till the nineties. That's why he even chance, dude. Oh my gosh, this guy's a piece of shit. Yeah, like it's Fuck bad. Fuck this guy. He's dead now. Oh, but... good. Oh, he is. He's yeah. He died. We looked when? up. We should make a cake for his death day. It was like two thousand three. No, what? Um, what's the what day? What I'll day? look it up real oh. quick. But, um... We should have a party on that day. Or something. What? Oh, Jesus what a ter- <laughs> no, what a the terrible, day terrible Ferrigno person. Died. What a shit Maddie Ferrigno birthday party. Forces his son to do this. No, not this. birthday, not birthday party. party. Death, death day party. Death day party, my bad. Uh, then oh, you dude, it. you can't go to town. It's Maddie Ferrigno's death day. <laughs> no, with context with the shit he said in that movie, that makes yeah, him sick. Yeah, that's why. such a rat vile No, uh, I thought roach. I thought they uh. Um, uh, amped up the, uh, you know, how crazy he was. Like, you know, how much, how, like, you know, like, he was, like, you know, involved. So did I, how involved. They but no, it was the total him. opposite. They amped they up him being nice. Yeah. They amped up him being, uh, like, you know, just happy for Lou and, like, proud and stuff. Oh. Like, no, it was the total opposite of that. Jesus. But yeah, I mainly saw this because there was, like, a video on, like, the 1992 Olympia where uh, Lou Frigno, like, comes back. And he mm-hmm. has, like, you know, his, like, comeback. And he looks amazing, by the way. He's, like... Like it's it's kind of, it, it, that's what makes like that moment so special, especially with um ha- what happened with his dad and like you know him just being completely discouraged after that. Mm-hmm. So like the comeback is, and the comeback Wait, being did he so. Win first. No, but like he got that tw- would have been fucking. I insane. know that would have been crazy. He got that would be a movie. I think now. he got eleventh or twelfth. But the thing is, like the level of competition in the nineties was like the greatest it's yeah, ever ever yeah, been. Like yeah. the nineties is like the peak level of competition so him even getting 12th is like pretty good Mm -hmm. and it's like in just comparison with like other people he looked gigantic Mm -hmm. he was probably like the biggest guy on stage he was over 300 pounds i think wow because you know he was like six four right yeah so he has he can pack a lot of size on like you know his frame Mm -hmm. and so he was huge so like that comeback i thought was like you know really like you know kind of inspirational in a way so props to luke right now oh is the hulk yeah i don't know when he did that do you know when he 70s. did that? The 70s? Late 70s, oh, really? I okay. believe. But, oh yeah, well, I was going to look up. Well, are we looking up Matty Frigno's birthday or the day he the died? The day he died. Do you know Daredevil and um, Thor were in the Hulk show? Fun fact? Like the, the, no, I didn't know that. Oh, I knew yeah. that, actually. 
Wow. Yeah, it is they... 2003. August 21st. August 21st. Mm-hmm. What a fucking ass. <laughs> <laughs> Well, mark the day, Greg. We'll have a... I don't hate him it that is, much. It is pretty that's crazy, terrible. though. Like, that's really bad. Damn. I mean, he looks big, but I want to see him, like, next to some shit. I didn't think he was that big in the Hulk. Compared to Pumping Iron, he looks crazy in Pumping see. Iron. I mean, he looks like a scary monster. Oh, that's great, though. Let, what, that's a, good, a really good picture. <laughs> No, yeah, that is pretty good. I don't know. It, it, just, it no, looks it really cool. Is. Like, it's a good shot and stuff. Yeah. I forgot that, like, you know, he's 6'4", too, so he literally is exactly, gigantic. Yeah. yeah, it's not that just that he's just It's not just, like, a musculature tall. kind of Yeah, I believe, just, I believe so... that. Yeah, like I'm saying, that, I would be scared of that. That, that doesn't one. look cheesy. Yeah, that looks pretty good, actually. Yeah, I, I thought it was like, cheesy. Yeah, the lighting. It's, like, out in the daytime. And... What is that? And these like, aren't even pose. ripped. They just like capri. <laughs> also, this is <laughs> <just> really tight <laughs> pants. Yeah, they're like, really? yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> so just like chinos just cut. Yeah, this looks dumb as shit. <laughs> Wait, go to that, to that, the one above it. Oh my god, this that one? one? No, 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 the greener, the green, the green, one, green the really green one. one. Yeah, that looks. Whoa, uh, that looks weird. That's cool. Go to that one. Like whoa, <laughs> I love oh that god. one. Who, that who looks is, cool. That's, I forgot he's not. That's Bru- he's not Bruce Banner. I forgot. David Banner, that's his name in the show. Okay, we're looking at. That's what I say. Great podcast material. Uh, looking at Hulk. Um, yeah, look up doing Bruce that. Bruce as the Hulk people. It's not cheesy. It's pr- it's kind of neat. Kind of yeah, neat. He looks pretty cool. You see that guy on the street? My dad used to love you, that huh? show. He would be on TV all the time. I never seen a lick of it. It's yeah, you know it's. Lick. It's exactly what you'd expect. I've seen, like, clips of, like, I know Thor's in it, right? Yeah. Yeah, like, though, and Thor looks weird. Yeah, they don't look like... strange. They don't look like... Those pre-90s superhero look so weird. Their costumes and everything, it's... And the whole vibe of the movies just seems so odd. There's also a 70s Spider-Man show. A lot of people remember that. I don't think I've ever... It's like a one season. Those look terrible. seen or anything. Yeah. Oh, give uh, everyone your review of uh, the uh, Star Wars uh, the oh. new movie. Well, I'll, I'll briefly talk about because I'd like to do a podcast with the people who've seen it. That's a pretty good idea, actually. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I thought, could we get, get really into it and then just have a whole Star Wars thing, you know? Okay. But briefly, the more I think about it, the more I don't really like it. Oh, shit, really? Yeah. Damn. It was really wow, just... Wow, I didn't think you would... I, I, I... I didn't think you would have a change of heart that Did you fast. like it afterwards? Yeah, yeah but I did. His, it is weird. I don't know. It's just going to... It's so soon. I need time to <sighs> yeah, really... Yeah, true, true. And my thoughts on those movies are always constantly changing. Mm-hmm. There's always like, oh, you know what? That one's pretty good. That one's pretty bad. Um, But yeah, overall, I enjoyed it while I was watching it. But then it was like, when me and Sam were walking, we were like, yeah, I liked it. But that's like all we could say. Yeah. <laughs> Like there, we didn't really have much of a conversation about it. This is this is what I think. You know, a movie is good when it doesn't get worse the more you think about it. Oh yeah, completely. It, and people can see that as like a nitpick kind of thing, but it's not necessarily nitpicking. It's just kind of no. like just noticing it, just like being real about it. And yeah, yeah, that's a good tool to use. Mm-hmm. That's it. It's like a, the complete opposite of Lighthouse, where that movie got better the more I thought about it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. That's when you know a movie is really good. Yeah. Um, yeah, Last Jedi was a lot better. This one played it safe completely, and it was like everything that people wanted. Like, yeah. Just like, you're just near, it was just like, yeah, but you know, whatever. Because a movie can be entertaining, but, like, for a movie to really stick out, it has to be memorable, too. Mm -hmm. And so, like, yeah. It is what it is. It is what it is. People, don't get too ups. Don't freak out. It's just a movie, you know. (laughs) No, there's people that are pissed. 
like the people who hated Last Jedi, like you know, like uh, that didn't like they Last Jedi. They get Je- so fucking mad, dude. Yeah, they got, the Last they got Jedi like, people like, lost like, their fucking minds. Yeah, it was that ridiculous. was unwarranted. I really do think that was a little bit unwarranted. You could have completely not, unwarranted. You could have not liked the direction. Even if it's just a really bad movie, it's but, like, like chill. Even the changes. <laughs> yeah, that's what, yeah, that's yeah, 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 yeah. But like even the changes and like you know the things that they were doing, I don't think they were that like bad. Like I thought they were just trying to. Like, spice it up a little more. I like them, like, you know, killing Snoke. I like them, like, mm-hmm. you know, subverting your expe- expectations at least a little bit. Like, I like that. Because, like, everyone had so many stupid theories about, like, oh, what is Snoke? Oh, what is Phasma? What is this? What is that? <laughs> and it's like they haven't even given you a chance Sounds to, like, like even... you didn't know what was going on, Josh. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, like... <laughs> But like you, you see what I'm saying? Like it's like they yeah, made no, up yeah. all these things no, yeah, yeah. and stuff, and it's like you don't know what they're gonna do. Like stop like pinning them down to something. Let the yeah. movie like let the writers like yeah, take off. the series like where they want to, and not have your expectations ruin it. Because guess what? I guarantee their expectations is what ruined Rise of Skywalker. Mm-hmm. They had to play it so fucking safe. They had to bring Palpatine back because they the last time they tried. You know, getting a different director and trying something a little more different, it yep. was like the worst thing in the world. They wanted to burn Disney to the ground. Yeah, it was ridiculous. They wanted to like just take ownership away, like <laughs> uh, impeach them or something. Um, I don't know. And also a thing about uh back to like what people are expecting of these movies. I think like the twist in Empire Strikes Back like, you know, the I am your father yes, thing. Yes, yes, yes. Like, that's probably the best Star Wars moment, but it's also kind of affected the movies in a negative way, where now people just want, like, every movie has to have a big, like... Twist, yeah. And, and that the writers try to do that and force it when it's, yeah, it's it not ruins natural. it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, Ray's parents and stuff, is it's that's the biggest... It's, yeah. I so. think the biggest missed opportunity of this entire series is not utilizing John Boyega, like I said. Yeah, uh, like he's I such a good yesterday. actor. Or Oscar the Isaac, thing is, too. We have seen, you know, lonely kids on desert planets playing in the sand. You've seen it, like, two <laughs> other times. And you see it a third time? Like, that's the main focus of yeah. the movie? So, like, I thought it was, the, like, the John Boyega. Like, it, it, what if, like, you know... Someone is, uh, you know, like, you know, like, a, like, you know, in the, what, what is the bad side called? The first order. The, yeah, like in the part of the first, or, first order, and then, you know, they changed like their morals or whatever, and then they they Give went to the side, and like, you know, if he was the Jedi, that would have been a really interesting, different angle to go with, but they didn't do that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They suck with they, they ended John Boyega's uh storyline like immediately. Yeah, he's he had barely has anything to do in this one. He has barely and no, he had barely any like after the first movie, he had barely anything to do in Last Jedi. True. I guarantee he has even less to do in he this does. next one, he right? He does. He definitely does. There you go. So and Ray like she's fine. Like she was a good. great I think she's a great actress, but at the but I think they wrote her character enough. like ass. Yeah. Especially with the way she got her power. I, I think it's I all think performance. All the appeal to that character is all the performance. Uh-huh. So, and even then, it's, it's, act- it's not ju- enough to make characters. up for it. Uh-huh. I think the acting of all these characters is pretty decent. Yeah, they they wasted some really great actors. Yeah. Oscar Isaac is fucking amazing. He's... A- the in Ex Machina. He's, that's one of the best. Uh, movies. Holy yeah. shit! Yeah. Holy shit, yeah, dude. I that like... gave me oh goosebumps. God, I love that performance. Underutilized completely. He could have <laughs> given yeah, something dude, more. I, seen, I haven't seen those movies in a while, but I completely forgot. I can't remember one goddamn scene he's in now. Like, they, yeah. do they use him at all? He's just cut. Besides Force Awakens. He's not. He's barely Force in Awakens, it. Force Awakens. He's barely in it, and people were like gushing about it. I did, It was like I did not understand. What was so great about Poe that people were like, oh, yeah, Poe Dameron, he's my favorite character in the new Star What did he do? What did he do? He was hardly in the movie. I did not understand it. Oscar Isaac did nothing. He was written nowhere. And then I didn't understand the appeal at all. And in the second one, don't remember him at all. He's better. He's got much bigger role, but he's and not. He's that, just yeah. his his character is just that he's charming. You can't wait two. You can't wait two movies to give one of the main characters an actual like developing like plot line. Like I just I don't get that. I don't. Yeah. They they just wrote this these movies so poorly to begin with. 
Like right from Force Awakens. J okay, JJ fucked it up. <laughs> JJ fucked it up from the very first movie. I think that's what happened. They took him in this direction and they got a new director and the director tried to like make it better with whatever they he had and people hated it. And then they played it safe and they got JJ back and now it's over. And there's nothing to show for it. <laughs> <laughs> You're a bright ray of sunshine, aren't you? <laughs> There's nothing to show for it. <laughs> it's just as shitty as the prequels, dude. Are they really that much better? Um, I like storyline wise. Uh, I like I like most of them more than one and two, but because mm-hmm. those ones are those ones get rough. They're still fun to watch, but for me, nostalgia wise, but. Uh, but I think three is better than all the newer ones. Wait, three? What do you mean? Three? Yeah, like Ap- Revenge of the Sith. Oh, Revenge of the Sith. Okay. But yeah, enough. We'll have a whole podcast dedicated to this. So, you know, I think Palpatine down the pipeline the for nine movies. Think what? about that. <laughs> Palpatine's the main villain for nine movies. It. Well, yeah, he every is. single like just about very. Every uh, main come story on, guys, movie. come on. What the hell, man? <laughs> and there's two movies where they're uh, blowing up the Death Star kind of thing. Yeah, they uh, le- they uh, <laughs> they like to recycle stuff. Dude, Star Wars is not as good as people hype it up to be. Like, there's, like, so much just clear flaws with it. It's, I, yeah, I, I, I personally would say it's just the, the movies built around the original three. Yeah, that makes sense. That just, just, they all so take from that around. well. Every single other Star Wars thing, it's all taking it from it those three. It leeches off of it. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it, it, like, the it more I, really weird. yeah, the so more I realized, it's, like, out. everything is taken from that. It's all just that pool. Yeah, it's like making a new movie. Yeah. Did they write themselves in a hole? It's what yeah, it's like dude, is it is it cuz did George Lucas just lose it? Like I don't know what happened. I don't get it. Yeah, George Lucas just went Did it start shit. with the prequels? Like I don't I don't know. Who knows? No one knows. Well, <laughs> yeah. Whatever. I don't even know if Disney to blame oh. anymore. I really can't tell. I don't even know why we keep trying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gee. <laughs> I want... I think and, now, and you know what t- Tony... Do um, you know what Greg told me yesterday? That, like, Solo is, like, is, like, is the most hated movie from these, like, you know, these Star Wars movies, which I th- found very surprising. Why? Uh, because no, I think... No, why is it surprising? Because I thought he liked it uh, uh, after he saw it. I, I did. thought you told me you didn't like it. I, I, there was a very brief period where I did like it. <laughs> you probably uh, counted me during that time. Yeah. But it was like a day or two. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what happened with this one. Yeah. <laughs> See? Yeah. I, I, it's, I'm constantly... Gears <laughs> are always turning up here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> What do you hate about it? Um, it's all just. It's your least favorite movie you've ever seen. That's what. No, 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 not even, not by a long shot. I'll still, I still. What do you, what do you rate? This thing's I enjoy. What do you rate solo now? Five, maybe a six. Okay. If I'm being generous. So five means you have no feeling, positive or negative, to solo. No, I would say it's. I'd say it's. It's bad movie, but I don't think it's like an awful piece of shit. So when you sit through it. By the end, do you get a bad feeling? Like a, say little, like a little, a little tummy, yeah. <laughs> like a little tummy ache. Yeah, I really think it was... T- yeah, yeah t- I would definitely be below a five then. If five is just like, you know, smack dab in, yeah, like, I you think know, you no need feeling. to recalibrate. Yeah, you need to recalibrate. <laughs> Would you do? Would you do? Uh, well, like, bad hey, Greg, feeling. what's your, what's your score for uh, Solo? Are you calibrated? Solo? Uh, it's still a four, f- five. Oh, five. Below <laughs> five. <laughs> You're not calibrated yet. I, you guys, just, fine. It's a four. There you go. Four makes sense to me. 
<laughs> Whatever. Based no, on I what said you five said, five is like dead average, and you said it was worse than average. You said it was a bad five, movie. Four, four, four. You said you have a bad feeling by the end of the movie. That means it's below a five. I think that makes total sense. Yeah, yeah. I think yeah, I think five should be completely neutral. Yeah, a little bit better. Six, a little bit worse. Okay, yeah, fine. You're right. Four. <laughs> Jeez. Here we go. We convinced her to changing his score. Yeah, we get. You guys make good we points. Didn't, we didn't convince. His, we didn't change his feelings about the movie. Yeah, we just used. We just used his, his, use his reasoning and his logic. Yeah, and his scale. We just changed the scale. Yeah. Uh-huh. Well, now we're do, all do, set. Do, recalibrated. Do, do, do. Now we're all cali- Now we're all on the same. <laughs> Finally, page. I'm recalibrated. Yeah, we probably should have done this like before the eleventh episode. Or yeah. We probably should have calibrated our scales together. Like, <laughs> you know, before that's, we started. I mean, that's what I always used. Yeah, I guess that's what I was using too. Yeah, that's kind of you're clever of you. I'm not saying it's clever. That's just that's just how you do it. Oh, it's not clever. It's intuitive. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. What were your complaints crazy. about this movie? A uh, Home Alone. Back to Home Alone. Oh, we really shit. got sidetracked with Star Wars. Um, what did we already talk about? We talked about how I didn't hear your complaints at all. Yeah. Oh yeah, the camera, about... the camera thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But other yeah, than we that, talked about that. We talked about um, I don't want to talk about anything we already talked about. We talked about how. <laughs> Um, yeah, I mean, there, yeah, I guess there were just a few scenes that were, like, kind of, they were kind of doing the same thing over and over again, mm-hmm. like, with him, like, being in the bathroom, Dad needs to see that, like, every morning. He did see, it did, did happen twice. A lot of him. I liked the second one, because he was singing. House. When he was singing in the ba- when in the bathroom, yeah, I liked that fine. one. I don't know, I don't think it was any better, but I didn't think it was any I worse. really liked I thought it was scene. a lot better than the first one. He was like, <laughs> yeah, you know, I was I thinking about it. I love that scene. That's my favorite scene. I was thinking scene. about it, and I have to go to the grocery store, that and I have to get it. too. I don't yeah, so that's why I think it's <laughs> yeah. way better, the second one was way better than the first one. Yeah, but I didn't like the second one either. He was just singing into a comb. Wow. Come on, man, that's cool. He was cute. I thought it was boy. fucking awesome. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but yeah, pretty much. Uh, yeah, there were just some scenes that could be cut out too. For sure, there there could have been. This could have been trimmed down to an hour twenty five. How long was it? Hour forty two. I'd say an hour yeah. twenty five. Yeah. It could have been trimmed down. So a little, or a little, even even a trim it, so even trim those out, but maybe beef it up with some 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 more good shit. Up. Maybe build up the relationship. More with the tricks old man and trinkets. More. Trim it, oh, then beef it. That's enough tricks. And Get trinkets. some footage from the trap cut. <laughs> Please, I'm begging you. <laughs> the tricks you. and trap cut. Get some footage from there. Toss it in there. It spice it up. It. Toss it in the ending while the credits are rolling. Let it go. Let it fly, dude. No, absolutely not. <laughs> I think they should uh, strengthen their relationship with the old man. Maybe. You are. <laughs> How much what? more do you need strengthening, huh? Well, I I think they could have added to his character more. They only really had him talk once. They could have added a dad angle. The dad was non-existent. Oh uh, yeah, he really didn't anything. do much. Yeah, that was weird. That was really strange. Yeah. They could have included that one daughter more. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> they could have beefed up the movie with that daughter. No, <laughs> could have beefed up the movie with more footage of that. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> For everyone who's seen the movie, you know what I'm talking about. Like you know, know what we're talking the about. Cutest little six year old. No, it's uh, not. No, it's not that. She was a cute stop kid. It. What are you talking stop about? It right now. I thought she was a very cute kid, and I wanted her to have no. more screen time. She we're not talking shown. about her. What six year old, by the way? <laughs> <laughs> not even really. his little sis. He had a sister, a little sister. Yeah, he was like, get out of your sport. All I remember is, I thought Buzz was the only, like, sibling he had. The rest, no, he had those a sister. were all his cousins? Yeah, he had a little six-year-old he sister. He might have had another brother. Where was there a sister? I, I couldn't tell the difference sister. between brothers and cousins. Yeah, I really yeah, no. had no clue. I knew like Buzz was a brother. There's so many. I knew Buzz was yeah. a brother for sure because he had the room and he's the one that interacted <laughs> yeah. with Kevin the most. Yeah, so, yeah, Buzz was definitely a brother. That was the only one but I could be like sure about. who was like that Melbourne kid that was going to pee on him while he was sleeping? Was That was probably a cousin. Probably because it's not like he was new to the house. Did you see a different yeah. cut than us? No, no like, he's right. I remember seeing that. That was like right in the beginning when he's yeah. arguing with his mom. He's like, "I don't want to be up there with that little boy because he's gonna <laughs> piss in the bed." Yeah, yeah. Oh, you don't remember that, huh? No. Oh wait, yes, I do. Never mind. Yeah. I don't believe that for a second. What are you he's writing? Just, he's Nothing. You too busy saying, with I'm your a liar? Are you, did you write? I'm a liar. <laughs> <laughs> Are you confessing? Are you confessing right now? (laughs) I'm crying. (laughs) Uh, You're gonna find that and be like, what the fuck? (laughs) What does it say? I'm a liar. (laughs) Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Cat's out of the bag. I'm a liar. (laughs) (laughs) I would love if Donald Trump said that. (laughs) Dude, that'd be so fucking good. And the impeachment trial. 
<laughs> oh yeah, he got impeached. That's fucking crazy. Cats are <laughs> You caught me. You finally got me. I'm a liar. I, uh, I lie about a lot of things. I really do. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Yeah, I think it's crazy. He got him. He got him. Yeah, he's still, you know, there's still a trial. Doesn't that just mean he was charged? Yeah. So he like, just has yeah. a trial. And I, I read that he's most it's likely. Not it took gonna... forever just to charge exactly. him. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's gonna be fucking too long. And like, and the thing is, like, I already it's read that it takes so long, it's not yeah. even likely at all that he would even actually get convicted. Yeah. Because of you know the majority and everything. Yeah. So I mean, what was the point? It was such a waste of energy. Yeah. Because he's about to leave anyway. Yeah. Coming up. Yeah, that's crazy. That energy could have been used for something way Stay more. Stay away from our president. <laughs> that's what. That's let him more, do his fucking job. Let him do his job. <laughs> he's got people to help. But I saw like what he he's actually. He's got me to. He's got. I, I need his help. <laughs> <laughs> I've been writing letters. My letters I haven't been getting to because he was too busy reading his fucking. Donald Trump, mail. I need your help. <laughs> I but, know you're um, a liar. I heard that. Uh... <laughs> oh fuck, dude! I lost it. I had a thought and I lost. Donald it. Trump. Donald Trump, impeachment, wrongfully convicted. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, I heard like his like charges like that and like the evidence that they had like about like Ukraine and stuff. And dude, it's pretty fucking crazy. They wanted like them to like move in on. He was trying to force Ukraine into like move in on a political opponent or something like. Joe it's Biden. A pretty. And he I got mean, charged with swagger. Is that the official term for doing that type of thing? I move? think so, because it's pretty boss. Because that sounds pretty fucking <laughs> yeah, cool it's, me. yeah, it was, like, pretty crazy. I'm like, damn, he got charged for that? <laughs> wow. Jesus. Like, Interesting. I think, like, uh, yeah, I didn't, that's, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know about any of this He's shit. He's a one-of-a-kind president. I mean, I'll give him that. Wow. We'll give him that. Like, no, 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 that no one scrap. else is doing this shit. It's, like, it's pretty entertaining. Yeah, it is like the weirdest thing. It is the weirdest like mind fucking thing. So like, yeah, it's like because it's going politics. On? Oh man, it's politics, baby. Anything goes. And no, they did anything doesn't go. That's why this oh. is crazy. That <laughs> <laughs> anything doesn't go. That is everything going. Everything is going for him. That's what's so crazy. Yeah, I feel like a million bucks. I feel like a billion bucks. Because <laughs> he's a billionaire. <laughs> It's a good little voice. Uh, what are they called? You know what I mean. No, I don't know what you mean. Sound bite. Any of you mean sound bite. Billion bucks. <laughs> I feel like a one billion bucks. <laughs> I Dr. think Evil. million dollars goes well, and billion bucks sounds really nice. <laughs> <laughs> Say at a bank. Yes, sir, you have $27 in your check. Do you think you just... Take money. You shop for money. You pick out money. Million bucks, I feel like a million, million bucks dollars. would be good. Can I have that? Can you give me that? I know you have it. <laughs> give me that. That's a good it's a robbery. Key, yeah, that's a good what if. Cute way to rob a bank. <laughs> it is. It's <laughs> Can I have like a million bucks, please? I know you have it. And you pull a gun out. You start waving it around. <laughs> Dude, he's doing a really good impression right yeah, now. That's, that's like spot on. Thank you. <laughs> that's what I was going for. I'm glad you. Yeah, that was like very. See, that'd good. be scary. Like yeah. when you you're, you're all cute one second and then you start whipping that voice oh, out. Shit. <laughs> ah! This thing's poking into me. Oh! Right? I rearrange it. That's what's what happening to me. Oh. <laughs> I can't even see if it's flat. Right? Oh, there it's we go. flat. Like the earth, flat like the earth, mother earth. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> True. You... Yes? Agreed? No. <laughs> mother earth Mother Earth is not flat. Mother Earth is? She's got a body. She's round. <laughs> She's curvy. <laughs> yes. Curves are in Mother for earth. earth is thick. <laughs> and around. And round. In and... all the right places. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> Why aren't we taking care of Mother Earth? <laughs> Why aren't we doing that? This, this is a PSA. PSA. <laughs> yeah, PSA uh, take care Home Alone was pretty Earth. good, and we need to start thinking about our future <laughs> and if we're going to stay on this planet. 
Because if we are, then we need to make it somewhere that we like to call home. <laughs> we need, if this is place is our home, we need to treat it like a home. All right, no more throwing out trash. I don't want to live Or in you're a- getting evicted, bitch! Treat it right! Dude, that'd be cool. We, if you throw out trash, you get sent into space. You get shot, shot out how about into you're, space. How about you're the trash? <laughs> space How trash, about you be bitch? the trash for a change? Trash for a change. Donate. Donate trash for change. <laughs> and we'll send one litterer into space for every, tr- every, every trash you guys send to us. Please. We'll get rid of it. Well, we know it's too. We know, we know, we know how to take up. See, trash. this is these are the lengths we have Put to go to to get shit done. <laughs> these are the lengths we have to go to to get shit done because otherwise it's not gonna get done. People no one's are... fucking listening. No one gives a fuck. People are gonna continue to pollute Mother Earth, and she's gonna get sick. <laughs> she's dying. Save her. <laughs> one way or another, we're gonna save her. Whether you guys like it or not, whether you support this or not, whether you're alive or not, space trash or not, <laughs> most likely if you're listening to this, you probably are already space trash. You've already started. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna discuss more of this when we get Greta Thunberg on. When who the fuck is just... that? A space trasher? Yeah. Who who's Greta Thun? What? Thunberg, I think is her name. She's that Polish girl. Thunberg? I think Polish. What's her not name? Polish. What the fuck are you talking about? That's like. That is all for the activist girl. Never mind. You guys don't know. No, activist? I no, I I'm idea. so up to date. Activist? Crazy. Yeah. For like climate change. Yeah, I have no idea who this bitch is. I'm not up to Tony. date on my... <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. On my international on environmental um, figures. Yeah, I don't know a whole lot about the issue. I think the only thing that I do know about this issue is that Maria Thornburg's a bitch. That's the only thing I can say. Oh, for shit! <laughs> oh, come at me, You're Thornburg. gonna be space trash! <laughs> Thornburg, yeah, more like... You said all of that name wrong, so I, I don't even feel what's like her, bothered sorry, what's correcting you. Greta Thornburg. Oh! <laughs> I, 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 Thornburg. I feel like I'm getting the last name wrong, though. So I'm not getting Greta it wrong. Greta Thornberry. The wild Thornberry. Yeah. <laughs> Greta Gerwig. Sorry. Gertwig? Right. That was a... Hertwig? A, Greta, whatever, you know who you are. She's an actress. International actress director. slash environmental activist. Right? Yeah, man. Am I right? Yeah. Good job. Still don't know who she is, but... Is I... she in something? Who? Dude, who gives a fuck? He brought her up. Which one? Greta the H- Horn Witch. Thornberry. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Hornwitch. She's a... Uh. <laughs> she looks like a horned witch. Hey. <laughs> Jesus. Right. I think that's why I was thinking that was her last name. Because that's what, exactly what she looks like. I think that's where the... Uh, Shosh, what's your I think movie? you're wrong. I don't think it's a horned witch. I think it's a horned bitch. <laughs> oh, oh, Thornberry. Yes, yeah. yeah. Horn oh, bitch. Nice. Yes. Horn bitch. Horn <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Space trash horn bitch. Uh, that's what's gonna be, that's what's gonna be written on your tombstone. <laughs> <laughs> Hornberg, get out of here. Uh, Are you saying you really like it? this bitch? <laughs> okay. What the fuck? She's doing the right thing. And what is that? S- saving our planet. Fuck you! <laughs> Dude, fuck her and fuck you. Right, Tony, I mean, Sash, what's your movie? <laughs> Oh, what? Good, good question. What, what movie are we watching next? It's me? This is you. Yeah. Right? Yeah, you picked this, right? Yes. And I picked Gremlins. Yeah, so it's you. So I, so is Harry Potter not one of our picks? No, it's not yours. Oh, whoa. whoa. <laughs> it's a nicer way to say that, Greg. Sorry, no, it Josh, it's mine, not yours. I didn't know Thank if you. it was like a pick thing. But, um... Yeah, oh, yeah, you don't know we picked these. Hey, Shit. Why are you being so rude right now? Sorry, I like guys. the. I like the, um... Like the route we've been in right now, like the well, Christmas. Christmas is over, man. Like more like I just do Christmas all the time. Like <laughs> old Hollywood-ish movies, you know, like mm. like you know Gremlins, like you know, like more blockbuster e. Yeah, but they're still fun. pretty good movies, you know. Yeah, yeah, Terminator. Terminator, yeah, yeah, like yeah, like we've been That's in that boat. Ago, so I'm gonna please. continue the trend and go with the movie that mm. we were talking about the other day. Rush hour. Yay! Yes. Which one? 
Um, that's one? a very good question. It's either going to be one or two. I haven't decided. Ooh. I think that's a good little... Yeah! To, you know, yeah, no, baby! I'll say, I'll say which one. We can figure it out later. But that's a very good pick. Uh-huh. That is a great pick. I think two is more well-rounded and might be, like, you know, the best one. But, like, the first one is just, like, the first time they do it, you know? And the first time Jackie Chan and, uh... What's his name? I forgot Chris his name. Tucker. Chris Tucker. Like, that's the first time, like, they really are on screen, and it's actually pretty good. I like it. It's very... Yeah. You know, it'll, it'll probably be two. I think two is the better movie. Two is the more entertaining movie. I've never movie. seen two. Two. I don't think I've seen two either. Two is the good one. Two is a very good one. Wow. Oh, yeah, that's the one where... Oh, yeah, no. Fuck, yeah. Two is about to smack. <laughs> Whoop! Oh. Whoop! It's right. about to be a thrill ride. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone.